Well, Amber, at any moment of the day, Lexington firefighters could be called out to a scene. Oftentimes, that means spending several hours outside. So today, I found out what that means and how they deal with these extreme conditions. We were only at fire station number one a few minutes before they got the call. The call was for a busted pipe. Any exposed uh, pipes, any exposed to this, these cold temperatures for you know a given amount of time, you know that static water can freeze. Battalion Chief Jeff Nance says the calls they get this time of year in these types of temperatures don't really change from the calls they respond to, say, in the summer. The difference for us in this kind of weather, with a subject down or a missing person. Uh, it becomes more urgent for us because of the temperature. But this icy air doesn't only affect the people these firefighters are helping. We're not truly superheroes, so the, uh, the weather impacts us just like it does anybody else. The gear firefighters wear provides thermal protection from the heat of the fire, but it doesn't provide much insulation. And on top of that, once there's a fire, that means there's also water. Oh, so then when you put it out, You've turned all that water into steam. It's come back on you. It, it suddenly starts getting cold in there. It's cold outside. Now you're wet. You're cold. So although they may not be actual superheroes, both extremes, uh, really cold and really hot, have a drastic impact on what we do. They are still saving lives every day, sometimes in very difficult conditions. Now, the Lexington Fire Department also has a trailer that has heaters on it. They bring that trailer to scenes they know they'll be at for several hours, and it's used as a means to also help crews warm up. I'm reporting live in Lexington, Monique Blair, WKYT.